I've always felt like the abortion debate was a straw horse based on the fact that the right to lifers always knew and know to this day that in the United States there is no movement among the pro-choicers or whatever you want to call them to make abortions mandatory. Choice means exactly that. Choice means a woman in this case has disc discretion over the pregnancy and it's acknowledged to be essentially her condition. She is the one who will be carrying, carrying the child and caring for the child in the vast majority of cases. Uh, in some cases the choice of abortion is unfortunate. Contrary to a lot of propaganda that sort of belches forth from the web, women who seek abortions are not immediately grabbed in, as a general rule with spasms of intense regret for life lost. Many women who seek abortions and obtain them are vastly relieved because they recognize that this was a situation an individual who was not going to be cared for, couldn't be cared for by them, possibly would have medical issues and live a very short, miserable life. And therefore they sought that choice. The last time I heard Ann Richards, and I'll tie Ann Richards here, was on April 24th, 2004. And she gave a speech on this issue at a woman's march in Washington. And there were a million people there, easily. It was like being swept around Washington in the middle of an ocean of people men and women. Ann Richards went. She spoke in a room that they reserved for 500 and 1,500 showed up. And she said, I fear women will lose the right to have this choice in their life. She said, I believe that that is coming. And then she cried. And we all stood around and looked at each other.